Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Scorpio. This is for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the week of February 27th. No, February 22nd. February 22nd through the 28th. So we're going to see what comes up. February 27th may be a very prominent day for you because it came out of my mouth. So I don't know. What do we have for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for the week ahead? What do we have for Scorpio? Journey. So somebody's going to be taking a journey. Um, looks like crossing a bridge. Somebody could be moving. They could be moving. It's definitely packing bags, saying goodbye, going down another path. So this is somebody that is taking a chance. You know, this is a card of faith and trust, definitely. Moving forward with faith faith and trust. Twos are about faith and trust. And if you notice, this bridge looks a little scary. I think it's a scary situation. But... It's time. It's time to go down that path. Whoever this person is has definitely made a decision to uh, go. This person has been at a crossroads, and they've then it's been a period time of curiosity. And you know, this person, whoever it is, whether this is you or somebody that you're dealing with, uh, has made a decision to go in a direction that. It's probably pretty scary. This is a, this is a decision that was probably uh, somebody was reluctant to make this decision, but the decision is being made. I'm gonna face my fear. So somebody is definitely making a bold move. Um, so yeah, moving forward, going someplace. Traveling to a new destination. Put it that way. What do we have for Scorpio? Announcement. There's going to be a big announcement if there hasn't been already. Kangaroo, unsettled times, need to plan ahead. So I do believe that there's going to be an, an announcement that sends you on a different different path that forces you to face your fears or something is happening where you're going to be going in a different direction and I think it's a little scary. I do feel like it's a little scary. Unsettled times, you're probably going to need to plan ahead. You know, and maybe that's what's been happening or it's going to be happening this week. Whatever is happening, you need to have faith and trust. This is a change. So you are going to be uh, going through some sort of change this week. And it may be a little unsettling, whatever this change is. There will, there will be an announcement that sends you packing in some scenario, Okay. And then that doesn't literally mean that you're packing up and moving home or somebody else is in your circle. When I say send you pack, and you could be just walking away from somebody, you know? Either way, it's going to make you unsettled, okay? You may want to turn your back on the whole situation. So what do we have for Scorpio? Somebody else could be leaving as well. It doesn't have to be you. You know, somebody's obviously packing up, and I, I know I keep saying packing up, but we have a suitcase here. So it may have something to do with a suitcase. Something about a relationship, happiness. There's definitely an opportunity for happiness. Oh, partnership. We definitely have a happy couple here, or, or I don't know if it's a reunion, or two people that are getting together. This could be a marriage, it could be a proposal, it could be, um, whatever it is, it's, it's a couple that are getting together. We have two people that are, that are coming together. I feel like these people are meant to be together. They are definitely meant to be together.
Somebody maybe may have been planning to make a move towards a partner. If they have been planning it, they may be taking action this week. This is happily ever after. I feel for some of you, I feel like there's a reunion, and it doesn't have to be with you know a reunion can be with a soulmate from a past life. If you've been in a situation where there's been some sort of trouble, uh, things could be getting better because I see a lot of happiness here. Oh, in the past, there's been some heartache. This is suffering. So somebody, that's in the past though. So somebody has suffered. They have suffered over a relationship. They have been stabbed. They have been hurt. But there's a healing love here. There's a healing connection. Oh my God. This is building a new foundation, a strong, strong, strong foundation. This is financial stability, a happy, loving, comfortable home. Somebody is building a foundation with somebody that, or they're going to be, they're heading in that direction. Whatever direction you are headed, Scorpio, this is a long-term stable opportunity. Now, if it's not you, it's somebody that you're dealing with, maybe somebody that you live with. Somebody is headed towards a partner or they are going to be with a partner or they are with a partner that could last forever, okay? But I do see somebody taking a journey, maybe traveling or moving towards this partner. There could be a distance. There could be some sort of distance that is involved. But I do see long-term success, comfort comfort. Some of you may be purchasing a home, purchasing a building, um building up a business with somebody. We could have a business partnership here or we we have something that is uh the beginning of something very 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 good. After there has been some heartache, after there has been some pain, somebody's going to make an announcement that they are moving into or they're moving towards a partner that uh, makes them extremely happy. This is a spiritual blessing. We have a relationship that is coming together, if it hasn't already, that is uh, very, very long term. Okay, this is this is something that can br bring happiness and prosperity and abundance. There's a lot of abundance here. Some of you may be receiving a gift from somebody. Or, so, you know, what? I really want to reiterate that somebody, if it's not you, somebody is getting into a long-term relationship that could lead to marriage. Somebody may be wanting to get married because I feel like something about marriage. Anyhow, um, I do feel like if this is a scary situation and I feel like for some of you, it could be somebody that you live with. Um, that is taking a journey, you know, they're, they're going someplace, they're, they, they've been curious, they've been thinking about it, they've been fearful, and now they're leaving, they're, they're leaving, that, that journey card is leaving, that is going someplace, towards happiness, towards a commitment, towards, a, I don't know, a union that is very compatible, so somebody is definitely making a move that uh, brings them happiness, put it that way. I may have something to do with a father. You know, we could, we may have somebody here that has been not wanting to accept responsibility. It doesn't have to be a father. It could be a boss. It could be somebody that is in a uh, leadership position that hasn't been it hasn't been taking any action. Maybe they were in their ego. They had a lot of pride. You know, something like that. Um, Somebody hasn't wanted to accept responsibility. I do believe for some of you, we're dealing with a business owner or something like that, or somebody that is in a position of authority that has been hurt, that has been hurt really, really, really bad. And I feel like now I feel like now they just want to go. Now they just want to go towards happiness. There's been some sort of uh, disorganization 
we have somebody here that may have made a poor choice and now they've experienced some pain. For some of you, there's going to be a reunion. You are going to be affected by some sort of love connection or reunion. Whoever this person is that is leaving, because that is leaving, taking a journey, traveling. Because there could be traveling that is happening. They have been thinking about it for a long time. This does have to do with relocation. Somebody could be moving in or moving out. Okay, because this is a home and this is relocation. Whoever this person is that is making this move, and they are definitely making a move, has thought about it. For a long time and I feel like they had invested in something that wasn't growing maybe they were for investing in a partnership or a relationship that wasn't growing me because they didn't want responsibility or they weren't ready for a relationship maybe they were focusing on their job they were focusing on their money they were focusing on their business now there's some sort of change because Jews are about change so I feel like you're dealing with somebody who is uh, going to be announcing that they are going in another direction and they're going towards happiness put it that way if, if this is for you you're headed somebody may be headed towards you and you you know say you're single and you're watching this say you're single you're watching this somebody could be heading towards you and it you know this could be a uh, person that you've been waiting for, you've been waiting and waiting and waiting, and this this leads to something solid, something stable, something secure, and extremely happy. Some of you, this is a work situation, and you're going to be building up a work partnership with somebody that leads to financial a bit abundance. This could be a business where two people get together and they build up, you know, a business or an established establishment that is or becomes very, very successful. Successful. If you've been struggling financially and waiting for money to come in, things are going to change. Okay, you should be receiving abundance this week, some sort of payout, whatever. There's some sort of uh, there's a couple here that uh, is going to be extremely happy with their choice to work together. Put it that way. Anyhow, um, Some of you may be acquiring a new location there could be that is going to be extremely successful and it may come after a journey after traveling you know after making a big move that is unsettling and scary if that is the case there will be success don't worry about it wherever you are at it probably wasn't fertile or wherever they were at there was a lack of growth but wherever you're, you are right now this leads to financial success for some of you there's some sort of grieving Maybe it's grieving over a loss of a business or a loss of control or loss of a father even or a loss of a masculine energy. There's been grieving, grieving over that. Things are going to get better. Things are definitely going to get better. Um, things are going to change this week. We have somebody here that is losing control as well. They're losing power over you. I don't know who this is, but it's somebody who is very, uh, this is somebody that may break the law, that abuses their power, could be a narcissist. This is, this is somebody that is losing control over you in some way. You're going to be building, or somebody that you live with, or somebody that you work with is going to, or you're going to be working with somebody or something like that, that really brings you a lot of abundance. A lot of abundance is here. We definitely have two people that see eye to eye. These people have the same goals. All is not as it seems. We, we could be dealing with the Pisces. You could be dealing with the Aries. Um, all is not as it seems. There is an unclear and difficult path ahead. 
I feel like we do have a, I feel like we do have a Pisces here. This is Pisces. Could be dealing with a cancer as well. Um, there is going to be a change. Somebody is going to make a choice. They've been fearful. And they haven't been able to take action. But things change this week. Somebody may have been hiding their feelings. There's going to be a big announcement. Things are going to start to grow in a very positive manner. For some of you, there's definitely a, a renewed energy or a reunion of some sort. We have two people that are meant to be together that are going to be together and they are going to build a business or a foundation that brings them a lot of money. All is not as it seems. We have somebody here that wants more than they have. And they may have been confused, or they may have been an illusion, or they may have not been seeing clearly. They may have been in their ego. But something is happening this week that changes their viewpoint. Maybe this person has suffered, you know? <laughs> Anyhow. I do believe that this is going to be a week of big change. Somebody could, I feel like there's travel. Somebody is traveling. They're traveling towards their, their destined person, you know, their soulmate. That's a soulmate. It is. I feel like this person has been unsure. They have been unsure if they've, they're making the right choice. Yes, this is the right choice. I do see long-term success here with a partner. Somehow it is affecting you. You also have somebody here that may be giving up their role. You know, when the emperor reversed, they're giving up their role as in a leadership as leadership and they're going to be working together with somebody on equal ground. It's like, you know what? We're going to do this together. So anyway, I do feel like this is a week of working together with somebody um, that brings a lot of success. Somebody you, you may be just hearing about somebody that is headed towards, you know, a connection. You could just be hearing it. There's definitely going to be an announcement that may make you unsettled. I don't know. Somebody is definitely leaving. And wherever it is that they're going, they're going towards a partnership or a union or something like that that is going to make them extremely happy. This is happily ever after. It is happily ever after. This could be marriage, okay? It, it, somebody is going to be, uh, I don't know, for some of you it's a proposal. It could be even renewed wedding vows if you're already married. Whatever is happening, I feel like we have an individual that uh, has made their choice. They've been unclear and they've been fearful. Maybe they were fearful of commitment. Fearful of change. Fear of the unknown. But now they're going to start investing in this new ground. Good luck.